All right, guys, welcome to a very quick tutorial here with converting strings to integers and then integers back to strings from here. So first off here, let's work on creating, excuse me, converting a integer to a string because that's probably the easier one to do. So first off here, let's do a public int and let's just make this uh, a, um, I'll make it num one and let's set this equal to something like 15 here. Now, if I want to convert this to some type of string here, maybe I want to display this on screen. I want to do something like that here. The way that I would go about it is very simply. If I go string, we'll call the string one equals, we're going to say num one, dot two string with parentheses from there okay and that's all i have to do and now this is now a string okay this is now a string that contains this value right there all right conversely if i want to do the opposite it's a little bit hard to do here but not too much harder here if i say int num two and this is going to be equal to string strong one <laughs> strong one i meant to say string one by the way a quick tip here if you double click on that it's going to highlight it i'm going to hit Control R R, and this is going to allow me to rename everything with that variable in the scene okay so if i go to the i String one, it's going to rename this one to here. Now, how do I convert this to an integer here? I'm going to say int.parse, and I'm going to put this in parentheses here, so it takes in as part of the argument there, okay? Now I can save this here, and if I want to do something like debug.log, oops.log, and I'm going to say something like num2 times num2. And this should print to the console as 225 if my math is correct, okay? Well, let's go back to Unity here, and let's go ahead and hit play. And now we're going to go to the console here and we see 225 from there, okay? So once more, if we want to convert an integer to a string here, we just say dot two string there. And if we want to convert a string to an integer, we say int dot parse. Now, one thing to be aware of here, if this string is something like, if I say a uh, string, string two, and I say something like ASDF here, and I try to convert that, you're going to run into some errors, okay? Just something to be aware about. Anyways, guys, great job on this video. You guys did great. If you guys enjoyed it here, be sure to give me a thumbs up, comment down below, and subscribe if you guys want, just want to see more videos. If you guys really enjoy it, I do offer some Udemy courses. Be sure to check them out. Links are in the descriptions down below. You guys did fantastic, and I hope you guys have a great day.